You know what's funny? Um, I actually set my new posting schedule to be at Monday, 3 o'clock. That's my new posting schedule. Every Monday at 3 o'clock, I will be uploading a new video. And today's Monday, you know, the day you're watching this video right now, um, it's about 11, 12 o'clock, so I have three hours to get this video up. I totally forget today's Monday, because when you're in my position, when you're in my shoes, you're not in school, you don't have a regular 9 to 5 job, right? You work full time from your computer, you don't have to worry about what day of the week it is. So I naturally forget what day of the week it is all the time. And I forgot today's Monday. So I'm gonna make a quick video for you guys. And I actually got this idea from an Instagram ad that I found. Um, for those of you interested in blogging, I wanna tell you guys, you can make a lot of money blogging. My brother, he runs a very successful blog for his gaming channel. Uh, he's basically a tutorial person teaching people how to become better at a specific video game he plays. And he has less than 3,000 subscribers on his YouTube channel. Less than 3,000 subscribers on his YouTube channel, and he gets over 1,000 visitors a day to his blog. And he doesn't even have any kind of ads or affiliate links on it, and I keep getting on his butt. I'm like, yo, you gotta put some ads, you gotta put some affiliate links. And that's what we're doing right now. So, you know, this gave me this idea for the, at the last second. I'm like, you know what, let me teach you guys how you can make money blogging, and I actually wanna show you guys an idea of what people are doing with a brand new blog and making money right away. So I wanna show you that right now. So let's go over to my computer and I'll show you guys how you can start making money uh, with a blog right now. Let's go. Okay guys, so we're here at the computer and I wanna show you a quick example. I kinda, I drew this, I actually went to this uh, virtual whiteboard website where you can draw your own stuff on a whiteboard. It's pretty cool, so I don't have to keep doing it on a physical whiteboard. So right here, here is exactly how it's going to work when you start a blog. So I'm going to show you the concept and then I'm going to show you a live example of a very popular blog, which you've probably seen online, maybe through some Facebook, Instagram ads, maybe YouTube ads, maybe you heard it on the radio. And from my experience, they've also had it on billboards. So when you're driving your car down the highway or on the road, whatever it may be, you're going to see a sign that says their blog. It's pretty cool. So let me show you right now exactly how this is going to work. So one, you're going to have a blog with affiliate links on the blog. So you're going to write a blog post and you're going to, excuse that, I'm getting a lot of messages. So what you want to do is you want to build a blog and have a bunch of affiliate links on the blog. So the first post that you could do, it could be a post about, uh, let's say dogs, right? And if you visit a website that has an affiliate program, you could somehow integrate that blog post with the affiliate link. So as an example, you're talking about dogs, and let's say you're talking about dog toys and let's say the blog post you're talking about your favorite dog toy that you used with your dog and he or she loved it by the way here's the link where you can buy the dog toy and you're an affiliate for that company so when somebody buys a product from that link you're going to get a commission so the way it's going to work is you want to create a blog post with affiliate links now let's say you're a brand new blog nobody knows who you are and you know you don't want to spend a bunch of money on tv ads radio ads whatever it may be what you can do is you can run some Facebook and Instagram ads to that specific blog post, not to your actual blog, where not to your blog homepage, but to that specific blog post. And you wanna target people who are interested in exactly what that blog post is about. So if you're making a blog post about dogs and cats, whatever it may be, you wanna make sure you target dog and cat lovers uh, because you don't wanna target random people. You wanna target people specifically for that blog. And I'm gonna get into the email list part because you wanna also target them so that you can add them to your email list. But I'll go over that at the last part. So you're gonna have a blog with affiliate links talking about a specific topic. And you wanna make sure that in that specific blog post, you are not pitching them. You're not hyping them up to buy a try out a specific product. You're just giving away free value. Gary Vaynerchuk says, jab, 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 right hook, but I say value, 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 then pitch. So in this case, you're going to give away a lot of value, give away your opinion, what you think about the toy or think about the product you're promoting. Then what you're going to do is you're going to have ads running to that specific blog post. Then what's going to happen is people are naturally going to try out the product, right? If you targeted the right people, if you if you crafted the entire blog post in such a way where you're not pitching them, you're just giving them free information. By the way, here's the link to buy it. Boom, you're going to get a commission. So once you get the commission, it means that somebody took the time to click on your ad, look at your blog post, and they say, you know what, this person gave me enough value to the point where I'm going to take his or her recommendation by buying the product that they recommended. So it's kind of like a YouTube channel in a sense, you know, except it's through a blog post instead. Think of it like that. You know, you're making a review video of a product and when they buy you the product through your link, you get a commission. It's the same concept, except you're doing it through a blog post. Now, after they buy the product, they are most likely to enter your email list. 
Uh, I've had experience with this before. I would have a blog post, I promoted it, somebody bought a product and they would subscribe to my email list because if they buy a product from your recommendation, they're most likely to subscribe to your email list because they wanna stay up to date with other blog posts uh, you're gonna make to see if they're gonna like that product you're gonna promote as well. And it's a never ending cycle. So as you can see here, it's like the, the circle of life, except it's the circle of blogging. You're gonna have a blog post with affiliate links. You're gonna run some ads to that specific blog post, and then you're gonna get some commissions. And you wanna make sure that before or after you get that commission from that person, you wanna get them subscribed into the email list. So in this case, it could be through a website pop-up or it could be at the very bottom of your blog. It, it could say, enter your email to stay subscribed and get notified when I come out with a new blog post. When they subscribe to your email list, guess what? The next blog post that you create, boom. <laughs> There's gonna be an affiliate link on it and they buy it, right? And then it's a never ending cycle. So this is how exactly it can work. Now let me show you a live example of what I mean. Uh, we're on a popular blog, you've probably heard of it, it's called The Penny Hoarder. Uh, this is all over Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, even radio ads, and even a, a billboard I saw while driving one day, this was like a year or two ago, I forgot, but it's one of those digital billboards so they can just you know replace it easily. They don't have to go up there and manually put it up. They probably paid like a thousand bucks or I don't know how much they cost, but they probably paid a good amount of money to have that up there. So it says this free tool can help score you a refund if your package shows up late. This is the exact blog post that I saw through my Facebook or Instagram ad. I forgot which one, but I forgot to take a picture of it. I forgot to save it, but I eventually found it on the website just by looking it up. So this really caught my attention because do you know how many times we buy products online and the package shows up late? So this really caught my attention. So I read the post and I realized, wow, okay, they did exactly what I just taught you right here. So as you scroll down with a new delivery monitoring, you can read this entire blog post if you want. You can go to the website, look it up, um, but I'm just skipping through to show you exactly where their affiliate link is. Here's the link to download the app and sign up, right? So when you click on this specific hyperlink they added, it's gonna take you to their affiliate link and let me show you. It doesn't matter which link. All of these highlighted things, all these highlighted words are gonna take you to the affiliate link for this specific company. In this case, the company is called Paribus, something like that, right there, Paribus, P-A-R-I-B-U-S. So when you click on it, I want you to keep an eye up here. Parabus.co slash click ID, right? Which is basically a referral link. This up here is a, is a referral link. If it doesn't just say Parabus.co or Parabus.com, whatever their domain is, if it doesn't say that and you see a bunch of letters and numbers and it says referral ID, you know, then that is an affiliate link. So they're getting paid to uh, promote this, right? Which I'm pretty sure is through an affiliate program. And a lot of these websites, sometimes they do have an affiliate program, but it won't say it at the bottom you have to reach out to them directly. So in this case, they probably reach out to them directly, ask them, hey, do you guys have an affiliate program so I can promote you on my blog? Or once you build up a big enough blog, companies will reach out to you and say, hey, you know, we wanna feature you or we wanna feature our product on your blog. Is it okay you know, if you sign up for our affiliate program? Not only will we pay you for a sponsorship uh, for you know, a one-time post, but we will also let you into our affiliate program so you can get some you know, 10, 20% commissions per every uh, sale or referral you get. So that's also the benefit of having a blog. Having a blog is very similar to having a YouTube channel or an Instagram page, right? The bigger you get, the more people want to do advertisements on your page. So it's a win-win to have a blog and stay consistent, you know? And I'd say the fastest way to build up your following on a blog is post content that is very engaging. A lot of people post very controversial content. In this case, the Wall Street Journal, New York Times, right? They post a lot of controversial content just to gather a lot of views on their blog. And in this case, when they you know click on ads, they'll get ad revenue, Google AdSense, and it also drives traffic to their affiliate link. So it just depends on what kind of content you want to upload. But a lot of times, just like on YouTube, people upload drama, you know, controversial content. The blogs that post that content also seem to become very successful. But it doesn't matter what kind of blog you make you can become successful uh, with any content you upload. You just gotta stay consistent. So if you don't wanna build it 100% naturally from the ground up through word of mouth, then you can try doing some Facebook ads, YouTube ads, um, Google ads. You just gotta do some very unique ads that you're gonna promote. You can't just make a post saying, hey, follow my blog or check out my blog post. You have to become very creative with exactly the kind of ad you're making and the ad copy. If you wanna see exactly how you can make a blog in just a few minutes, uh, you can head over to simplore.com and we have pre-made templates to help you get started with that. So you just click on the template section and 
when you scroll down template for that so you can go to personal if you go to personal you'll see these sections here we have like photography blogs you know travel blogs um, here's one of our most popular blogging templates Wi-Fi is loading it see videos nature you know you can change up these topics but this is just a standard layout to help you uh, start blogging or you can start your website from scratch and then you can add specific blog posts manually if you want to customize your website um, but a lot of people who start a blog using our builder here on simplore.com a lot of people choose this template uh, when it comes to getting started out so I think this is gonna be a great way for you to get started and uh, building up your following with a blog so if you guys have any questions links are down below simplore.com and if you have any more questions, you guys know you can reach out to me directly on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, whatever it may be. I'm always here to help you guys out. So that's it. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.